This is Donna Emery at Glover Nursery in West Jordan, Utah. How to clip a white lavender plant. I have one here that's still in the pot and one that's in the ground that was pruned back last fall. You can use just scissors to clip off faded or dead blooms. And in the fall, you can just use the same technique to take this down to two or three inches above the ground. I like to clip them in midsummer too because then I get a second flush of bloom. Just fertilize afterwards in water and the flowers will come back. Now for this one, which was pruned down heavily last fall, we used pruning shears in order to cut these woody stems all the way down. Don't worry about cutting this too far. You can cut it all the way to the ground and it will still recover. I'll clean it up a little bit more today to get rid of some of the things that did not re-sprout. But you notice it's already recovering and it's doing just fine. We'll have lavender flowers here in perhaps another month. So which other met whichever method you choose, scissors, shears, or even a hedge clipper, it's pretty easy to prune lavender and it smells wonderful. This is Donna Emery. Thanks for watching.